Welcome to Tech Support. Today we'll be talking about how to split apart your polyphonic wave file. When doing a multi-channel direct to hard disk recording on the DL32R, it will save all of the recorded channels in a polyphonic wave format. If you're interested in doing a postmix of your multi-channel recording, you'll want to split the polyphonic wave file into mono wave files. There are a couple of DAWs that will split apart a polyphonic wave, but today we will be talking about how to split apart your polyphonic wave file with a program called Wave Agent by Sound Devices. First, we will need to go to the Sound Devices website and download Wave Agent. Now we can connect your external hard drive to your computer that has a polyphonic wave file and copy that polyphonic wave file to your computer. Open Sound Devices Wave Agent and drag the polyphonic wave file into Wave Agent. Once you have imported your polyphonic wave file into Wave Agent, you will be able to see how many channels the wave file is in under the channel column. Also, you will be able to see the time code, length, and sample rate of the polyphonic wave file. The 48 kilohertz will be the only sample rate option on the DL32R. If you double click on the polyphonic wave file, you will be able to play back all 24 tracks. Click on the split combine button. Once the split and combine window is open, you will want to click the Split Poly tab in the top center of the screen. Then choose the file destination and click the Process button. Once you have processed the polyphonic wave file inside of Wave Agent, you'll want to check the destination folder to make sure that your polyphonic wave files have been split into mono wave files. Now you're ready to import your mono files into your DAW and start mixing. Thanks for watching this Mackie Quick Tech video.